arrival at the Marine Science Center, you'll be greeted by staff who will give you a quick overview of the visit. You'll be split into groups to participate in three different activities. During one activity, you'll conduct scientific surveys of the rocky shore. You'll learn ecology techniques while exploring the plant and animal life of this exciting ecosystem. Oh, there's a crab! There's a crab! There's a crab right there! Grab it! Not only is this a pregnant crab, but it's also a rock crab, and we don't get a lot of those up here anymore. My favorite part was probably the tide pooling, because like, I'm really interested in like the ocean and stuff, so it was awesome to get to see some of those creatures up close. You will have to walk over and on wet rocks, so be sure to wear sturdy shoes that can handle a bit of water, like rain boots or old sneakers. You'll also get to learn some history and geology on a walking tour of an old military installation jutting out into the ocean. Story another time. Um, you would have heard about these uh, continental plates or bits of rock that would have uh, basically run into each other and collided. And you'll get up close and personal with the animals of the rocky shore during your time at the touch tanks. It was really cool because we were able to discover and explore by ourselves. It was more hands-on than you usually get in like school. It's like a common periwinkle. In the little tide pools, there were clams and snails and crabs. It was really, it was really fun. The trip is lots of fun, but it's best to be prepared. Bring layered clothing, boots or shoes that can get dirty, a water bottle, sunscreen, a hat, and a positive attitude. Don't bring expensive electronics or valuables, anything that can't get wet. I just highly recommend this trip. It's a great opportunity for the kids and the staff here and the graduate students are very knowledgeable and it's a great place to have students learn more about the you know, intertidal zone. See you on the rocky shore.